I just left Craters of the Moon National Monument in southern Idaho. It's really an amazing place. It was named in 1924 uh, by astronomers, and they thought that's what the moon looked like to the best of their knowledge. Well, I would say that it looks like the moon, and in some places it almost looks like Mars, you know, the pictures that we've been seeing from the rovers, the various rovers. But it's very unearth-like for sure. Um, I stayed last night. The campground is really pretty, um, you know, right in a lava field. But um, I thought I'd see some stars because there's no civilization around there. But the forest fires, there's so many forest fires in Idaho right now that um, the sky was just thick. As a matter of fact, my eyes were hurting me last night. I figured I'd probably just have to leave early this morning. But I got up this morning and um, it was, it was, the, the wind had blown away most of the smoke. So I walked around the campground, checked out the various sites. It's really a nice place and uh, $10 a night, $5 with a senior pass. Um, then I took the loop road. I've done it many times before, so there was really nothing new for me. But uh, just kind of a reminder of what's there. It's very pretty. Nothing's changed, of course, in 20 years. But um, it's a really nice place to visit if you're in southern Idaho, uh, near Arco, uh, which was the first town in America to be lit by um, a nuclear energy plant. That's where I'm headed now. But um, So that's my report for this morning.